Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and all in between. Jason, my brother, how you doing? I'm good, man. All right, so uh, we're going to be reacting today uh, to Winger Voodoo Fire. Ah. Now, Kip Winger, um, he was in the Alice Cooper band for a long time before he went in, uh, before he um, started his own band, Winger. Right. A uh, classically trained musician. Yeah. Um, has won a, even won a Grammy for one of his um, or or orchestration. Yeah, he's a composer as well. Yeah. yeah, and if I'm not if I'm not mistaken, I think his brother also uh, was like a session guy. They they did a bunch of session stuff too. Um, yeah, together back in the day, I think. Yeah, you know? yeah. He always, you know, they, you know, he got a bad rap for I don't even know why. You know, probably because oh. he was better looking than everybody else. Right. You know, it's you well, know, it's just, just like Bon Jovi did. But you know what? Who, who? I mean, those guys were like spitting out hits like it was you know, but his business. Oh yeah. Totally. I mean, and I saw, I saw, I've seen Winger a couple times. They're fucking great. Man. Oh, yeah, he did. He's such a talented guy, man. No doubt. Absolutely. So yeah. he's, he mentioned in an article that, you know, he may be wrapping up the Winger thing soon to concentrate on uh, composing, right? Composing. Yeah. Yeah. I, I saw, I didn't get to finish watching it yet, but uh, I saw he recently, you know, I think he has a, a podcast or, you know, some sort of, show himself and he had steve Vai on you know and of course you know we know Vai, you know composes as well and they were you know they were hashing it out about all that kind of stuff so it kind of makes sense oh, I you know? to check that out. yeah right on so let's get with it cool It's already a, it's a creeper. Yeah, it's got a good good riff, man. Yeah, you know? good vibe going. The whole world's insane. Dude, his voice was always fucking kick. It's to himself, you know what I mean. No one else sounds like him. Well, and you know what? I mean, let's not for nothing. I mean, none of us are uh, spring chickens anymore, and he's still oh, you know, still pulling it off. So absolutely. Russian vertigo sends me. Dude, and the players that he has with him are always fucking top notch, man. Oh yeah, Red Beach, what a what a guitar player! Oh, man. he's a, yeah, he's totally incredible, man. Rod Rod Morgenstein, come on, legendary drummer, you know. Oh, absolutely. Right. And uh, yeah, one of my uh, one of my friend's brothers was in Winger, now plays with Kiefer. Ah, oh. so yeah, he played with Kip for a while. So nice. I am hooked on your honey Also, Matt, yeah, that shit ain't easy. Uh, oh we, hell no, we, yeah, it wasn't easy in when we're in our twenties. <laughs> right. But you know, like you know, for a slower song and everything, 
dude, there's a lot going on. Yeah. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Yeah. And uh and that that black Spectre bass, he's plunking on there too, ain't too shabby. Yeah, and he's always been a underrated bass player in my opinion as well. Yeah. yeah. In there <laughs> what a, <laughs> what a cool way to end that man i mean coming out of like yeah a, totally a heavy, right. heavy like riff based rock tune right and, and that vocal melody sort of like was a little beatlesque to me i don't know if you oh, for, absolutely that. yeah yeah it, you know you, you know i was gonna say earlier i said this is a perfect example of how to write a great song and it doesn't have to be a million miles an hour man no. like it had everything going on heavy drums heavy foot nice groove you know vocals amazing guitar, you know everything the best tunes are always simple you know yeah yeah and uh so yeah everyone uh go check out uh kip winger's new album and this is uh been the reaction for voodoo fire so go see kip winger when he comes out so go see winger go buy winger Go see local music, go buy local music, but most of all, keep listening. Horns up. Thanks for the song, Kip. That was awesome.